G'day YouTube. This video is just a quick look at the latest released version of Ubuntu Mate 16.04. Now, Ubuntu Mate 16.04 is an official derivative of Ubuntu, and its main difference is the use of the Mate desktop environment, which is based on the older GNOME 2 framework uh, that was used for many, many years on Ubuntu. Let's call it Ubuntu Classic. Now, Ubuntu Mate is typically used by people who have a preference to the old Ubuntu desktop roots. So pretty much as opposed to the Unity graphical uh, shell of the regular Ubuntu at the moment. So something a little bit more old school. Now the latest kernel is used on Ubuntu Mate just as it is with regular Ubuntu, but we can always check these things out. And uh, you can also say that when you go through the menu, it is pretty intuitive in the sense that uh, if you have used uh, the old Ubuntu classic many many years ago. You just know where everything is. There's not many places to go And it's all there for you. So let's see if we try that Okay, so we can see it's got the latest kernel release, which is great to see uh, Moving on it is available in both 32 and 64 bit architectures So you can download it uh, at your will in any way that you wish Now the file manager is something a little bit different. So if we go to uh, file manager window here we go. So go across to the About section and we've got something called Kjar. So Kjar 1.12.7. Nothing new for Mate, but uh, it is different from a lot of Linux distributions in that it's just a different file manager. Definitely quite lightweight, I would think this one to be, and just yeah, easy to hop around, that kind of thing. Uh, the software is pretty standard, so you'll get a few things here and there, a few accessories, a few graphical applications, just the bare bones, uh, internet applications, and a few office applications, in particular Libra version 5 or so. Something I don't get into too much, uh, just in terms of explaining the, the software, because you can pretty much download anything you want and run it. So yeah, it's pretty standard there, that sort of stuff. And overall, it's just another a lightweight uh, Ubuntu desktop edition that speaks to users with lower spec hardware or just prefer the old look and feel of Ubuntu Classic, as I penned before. So that's pretty much it, guys. I hope you've enjoyed, and uh, yeah, thanks for your time.